Yes! The legislative branch comes through again. Uh, Mom, keep reading. Hmm. Quimby's cozying up to that sleazy video game producer. That really burns my beehive. I must hasten home to play my new carjacking game. <laughs> Give me a ride, jerk. Nothing a smile and some medical attention can't fix. Hmm, that video game's gonna turn every kid in town into stabby Sams and drive-by Bettys. Mom, I know how you could get that game banned. How? This manual tells us how to use superpowers. You mean I can talk to whales like Aquaman? Or do whatever Hawkman does? No, Mom. You have the power to convince crowds to do whatever you want. Just like Oprah! Okay, let's stop that video game. I feel just like the bell of the mob. Come on, everyone! Tickle me pink to join your street gang. It's an adult fighting, and then the city's really gone to hell. I don't understand why a mouse would be so demeaning to women. <laughs> Thank you. 
Animal Pie.
get myself worked up, I'm gonna pound the fuse with you.
Come on, come on. 
Congratulations, Quimby. You made Grand Theft Scratchy Day a tremendous success. Thank you. Why don't we celebrate with some interns? Sexy interns? Well, Springfield sexy. 
Oh, oh my. <laughs> I don't think he's coming out. We're going to have to use our secret weapon. No, Ned, not yet. I'm talking about Maggie. So I'm ready to receive my bribe now. Oh baby, the dollar sign doesn't lie. Dear God, we're not soaking, we're cooking! A mob of parents?! A s s s s senator Quimby, you specifically promised me no mobs. You said this town was full of slugs who would suck up our sexy sleaze with a smile. Consider yourself unbribed! Unable to secure a decent bribe, I have decided to flip-flop and ban sales of Grand Theft Scratchy for minors, the only people who want to play it. Mom, isn't it a little bit hypocritical that you're opposed to the violence in the Itchy and Scratchy game, but then you use violence to get your way? I'm sorry, Lisa, what? I, I, I just can't hear you over the roar of this appreciative crowd. That was so, so fun! Awesome. See what I did! Oh, that was, was the greatest incredible. day of my life! Oh man, all my life I wanted to be a human garbage disposal, and now I was! Homie, don't you think you could put your new powers to better use? Oh, like what? Eat terrorists and bar flowers? What did you do that was so great? For your information, I rallied the town to ban a very violent video game. Mom, if kids don't play Grand Theft Scratchy, they'll never learn real-world skills. Like how to sell guns or hunt for hidden packages. You should talk, Bart. I heard that you destroyed half the Natural History Museum. And that's my favorite place to find solace. And while we're on the subject of yelling at each other, your little stud with the loggers has put an army of regular Joes out of work. Way to go! Way to ruin lives! Of all the stupid facts! 
Kitty, you wouldn't know what to do with a superpower if your name Fuck was Charles Manson. Yeah, well, your name, yeah, that's right, Lane. Well, we're here, and it only took 300 decasols. You're the one who made us stop to visit your mother in space. Why do we always argue on spacecations? You're right, let's kill and space up. Job. Guys, listen, we've been given special powers, and if lazily written movies have taught me anything, it's that with superpowers come super responsibilities. So, on behalf of the town, let's go kick some alien butts. If they have butts to kick. Ow! Our powers aren't strong enough! We need to stop these spaceships, and there's only one person in Springfield who's smart enough to figure out how. I drink blue juice from under the sink. Oh, let's just find Professor Frank. <laughs> 